Hello, this is Mindy from The Weekend Gardener, and today I'm going to show you how to clean a concrete statue or a concrete planter. And what you're going to need is you're going to need your concrete statue or planter, a bucket with just plain water, a large brush, and a toothbrush. Now you may be wondering why I just said plain water. Concrete is extremely porous, and whatever is in the water is going to be soaked up by the concrete. So if you put dish soap or vinegar in there to kill any moss that you may have growing on your statue, those substances are going to be taken up in the pores of the concrete. In doing so, it could affect the finish you have on the concrete or any future finishes you may put on the concrete. So just keep that in mind. Just good old plain water will suffice when it comes to cleaning concrete. Now the process is pretty simple. You're going to put your statue or concrete container in a pail or pan of water and you're going to clean the large areas with a large brush. You're going to continue it until you get the large areas as clean as you would like. Then for those small little nooks and crannies, an O2 brush will do the trick. Now what do you do next? You're going to take your concrete statue or container out of the pail and you're going to put it out in the bright sunlight. That will kill any moss that's left on your statue. The solar radiation will kill it and so you will have a more pristine looking concrete item. Now the only exception to that is don't do this in the winter time. What will happen is the pores will fill up with water and you're running a chance of causing your statue or container to crack, much like it's happened with this statue. It's a good idea to clean your concrete items at least once a year. And at another good time to do it is after you dump your containers and store them for winter. So until we meet in the garden again, this has been Mindy from The Weekend Garden.